All right, Lauren, let's go back to the markets. Uh, we've got some gains for the Dow, 200 up, but the Nasdaq turns south again. Look who's back today, David Barnson. Uh, I would like you to address the 8.3% inflation rate that was reported this morning, an hour and a half ago. Do you think we are at or close to peak inflation? Yes, I do. And I think that the number that it's going to come down to is going to still be way too high. But then they're going to start playing into the narrative of the disinflation. I'm mostly focused, as Liz just talked about in the last segment, on energy inflation, because that's where I think the administration can have an impact. I don't think there's much they can do on the inflation that's coming from the supply chain side. But I think goods inflation is starting to head down. Is that why the market overall is up? No, it isn't. The market's not up enough to have a reason to be up. With this kind of volatility, 200 points here and there is what we call a lunch break. Okay. Uh, first dividend pick, H&R Block. What do they pay and is that dividend growing? <laughs> yes, I would like to point out that I sent this to your producers before it opened up 14% this morning. Uh, it's been a pick I've talked about on your show before. Um, we've really had great returns from this name. H&R Block just reported last night. You have a 4.6% dividend. They grow the dividend every year. They bought back 13% of their stock last year, which, by the way, grows the dividend because they're now paying the same dividend to less shares. So it's a backdoor dividend increase. But they had a great quarter, Stuart. We love H&R Block. Yeah, yeah, fine performance today for sure. Simon Property Group, the big mall operators. Yeah, they reported a couple of days ago, they've grown their dividend 21% from where it was a year ago. Many people thought two years ago when they had shut down all the malls in the country, that Simon was going to end up not collecting any rent. Well, guess what? They're at 94% occupancy from the best quality tenants at the best quality malls in the country. And they're paying, and this is what Stuart Varney loves, 5.75% dividend yield. Wow, that's pretty good. I'd take 5.7% from Simon Property Group, and I'd also take 4.6% from H&R Block. That's all we've got time for, David, but a lot of people really concentrate on, on your offerings every week. It's all good stuff. Very popular. David Barnson, thank you very much, sir.